The monetary system has forced us to migrate to different parts of the planet searching for better horizons. This has created uh, belts of poverty around the main cities. This forced displacement has caused a great many cultural values because we have been forced to assimilate different ways of life. But what's worse, we have been subjected to cultural and cultural exploitation. We Indians, the first children of Mother Universe, will not accept being called immigrants because we are moving through our ancestral lands. We will not allow constitutional rights to violate our natural rights. The Indians have come to the great cities where the urban white culture considers us immigrants and racial and religious segregation. That is why the urban Indian communities must fight to stop this assimilation. And something dramatic is happening among those who have gone to the U.S. and Europe. An odious policy of racial discrimination against our displaced in these states, mainly in states such as Spain, and it is they that have plundered and committed the ecocide side and ethnocide against us and have the greatest debt. Now they have come back with xenophobia and discrimination used to acknowledge crimes most degrading jobs and pay us the lowest salaries. That is why on the situation of the indigenous peoples in the great urban centers to compile the accusations and defend the uh, plight of this great contingent of people that is being discriminated. Thank you. Thank you for the statement from Cisa Ancano, Mr. Ivan Ignacio. And now we have a joint statement from the Yotamira Linep, the TP. Ya volvemos con Noticias en CTV.